Hello everyone, welcome to Chess Until I Win. Yes, that's this entire video. I have to play chess until I win. Or until three hours pass. Total time. This was originally intended to be a live stream, but I can't live stream it for three hours. Because there's an emergency family event I have to go to that day. So I can't go that day. So I'm just going to do this instead. Anyway. I was going to go... Play life just 10 minute matches until I win. That's what he's doing. I'm gonna take the center. Wait, it's Kyle. Okay, it's not Kyle Khan. It's whatever the heck this is. Okay, I'm playing against like a, an idiot or something. I don't know. But he just let me take the center. Think bishop there in castles. Let's just stop you from moving. And I have an escape square that I can go to. Let's just stop this dude. Keep the sensor strong. I guess I can trade the pawns. Let's go here attacking the pawn. I'm not doing a face cam this time. Okay, this could be a win. My opponent's not playing the best. If I win, I'll play another game. So you guarantee at least three games. If I win any of those three games, the video will just end after the third game. But if not, I have to continue going. Okay. I might just win because he's not playing all the moves, like, on time. I'm thinking he's trying to think, is knight b5 a decent move, or is it garbage? Something along those lines. I could put a knight on g4. I'm thinking of my next move. Knight to, on g4 if he doesn't move the bishop up to the two squares that occupy it. Oh wait, yeah, I can do that because the queen can't take, also I'll take the queen. But 
Bro, you have to castle. Move the queen and castle. Actually, that side's bad. Move the... Move the knights in... Mm. Actually, you gotta move the knight in front of the king so I can't stop you from castling. Then you can castle that side. But, bro, you gotta castle. You EFK? Okay, whatever. Um, I think I will count draws as I have to keep going. So if I draw, then I lose. And then my opponent resigns, then I'm just going to continue on because I have to... Actually, no, I'm not going to save my target with signs because then I'm going to have to do another game. Just try and get the... This dude is not... This dude's not doing anything. Okay, I can look down here. Okay, he won. I won my resignation. No, go back to the game. Okay. E4. Is he going to play E4? E4, D5. Maybe... F5? Maybe the... Uh, okay, he's... Car defense. I have no idea what that is. What you're trying to do. Okay. Yep. Put my bishop there. Uh, I'll move my queen this way. If he takes with the knight, if he takes the knight, I'll take the with the pawn. I'll have a half open file for my rook. Plus, I can stop him from Castle. Okay, I'll do this. I can stop him from Castle if it's right. He needs to move the Queen and Castle. Bro, why are you retreating? And then you go back. Look, like why? Go there. Stop him from castling if he decides to castle that side. Actually, I think I'm just going to win three games, because this is going pretty smooth, actually. I have no idea what that move is. I think it's a free pawn, not guarantee. Okay, yep, he's just... I have no idea what he's doing. Thanks for the queen, I guess. Okay. Okay. New goal, win three games. What the frick?
Okay, let's see. Does he take the... Does he do on Passan? No, he does not. What is he even threatening? Let's just boot the bishop. I think I win the bishop, actually. I can go f4, trapping the bishop. If he goes queen g6, I go bishop f6. Yep. Okay, I move the bishop back. I'm just playing defensive aggressive. Is he going to take... Okay, he does not take the pawn. Um, if he takes the pawn, I can't take with that, and my queen would be in danger. So, uh, let's just move there to defend the pawn. Can I fork the king in the, uh, the other piece? Can I fork the king in the rook? Okay, I can't. Sad moment. Let's just go there, boot the queen away. Oh, I get the rook anyway. Oh. Oh. Well, I get the queen. You should have just moved your queen and lost the rook.
Okay, can I win the rook, or is he going to move the rook back? Okay, he's going to move the rook back. Okay, I'm going to overload that knight. And to get ready to attack that square. I'm pretty sure I'm in, I need to, to win, I need to put my rook on g6. Wait, I think I might be able to do this. The king has to move back. I go over here and the king can't move to any of the three spaces.
Did he rage quit? Did he leave? It's four Spain in two. Nothing can guard the king. Nothing can take my queen. He asked me if his king to h1. I take the rook on c1. Checkmate. Because the king can't take his own pawn and can't move into the direction of the queen. I'm just not going to touch the queen. Because I'm afraid that I'm accidentally going to put it to the wrong space. And not be able to deliver mate. You should not have moved your rook there, bro. You should have moved it back. Okay. I mean, there's nothing that Ron Cause 889 can do. I'm just confused why he moved his queen out so early. Okay, he's not rated eight, eight, nine. He's rated seven five nine. Got it. Three seconds left on the clock. He's running out of time. Is he going to go into forced mate or is he going to run out of time? He runs out of time. Okay. Oh. Not sure if that's... Okay. I need to... Let me just look at the Alfalfa. Shin. July 7th. And since then, I've completed three games. I'm just double checking this. Thanks for watching.